Hi, this is Marty from Blue Lightning TV. I've gotten many requests for a tutorial on how to install fonts, so I'll show you how to do it in Windows since that's the operating system I'm working on. Macs have different steps, however whatever your system is, fonts ultimately end up in your fonts folder. Before we start, make sure Photoshop is not opened. There are many websites that offer fonts for free. For this example, I'll choose a font from defont.com. I'll go to Western and choose Gunslinger. Click on the Download button. Most, if not all, fonts requires file extracting software to unzip it. If you don't have such software already in your computer, you need to install one. There are many to choose from. Just type in your browser, File Extraction Software. Once it's installed, and after you click on the Fonts Download button, you should see this window. Choose Open with whatever your extraction software you have, and click OK. In Windows 7, you need to have administrator access for the font to be installed. Assuming you are the administrator, click Yes. Once the font folder is unzipped, there may be a few files in it. Click on the one that either has a TTF or an OTF at the end. Immediately, you'll see a window that shows you all the characters, as well as what it looks like in increasing sizes. Click Install. If you don't see this window, click Start, Computer, Your Local Disk, and Windows. You should see a folder named Fonts. Simply drag the font file into the font folder. Now open Photoshop, go to Window, and choose Character. Open your list of fonts, and you should see the font you just installed. Call up your Type tool, and type out your text. This is Marty from Blue Lightning TV. Thanks for watching.